Hi, this is Jim Herbanic, the rock guy. I'm a little tired, a little winded. <laughs> we are in uh, the McDermott Caldera area, and you know, calderas are huge, so I, I can't just show you the rim of the caldera. But uh, we're uh, back on the Oregon side of the border, uh, crossed over uh, from the Nevada side, just a short distance from here. Uh, anyway, uh, we're at the cliff's edge. Uh, mine for thunder eggs and uh, I'm just going to back up to the edge of the cliff here I'm terrified of heights so just you know let me if I, let me know if I'm going to go over the edge and uh, uh, no I'm just messing with you not the cliff edge at all but uh, I want to show you the thunder eggs here because this place is off the charts, insane. So, you don't need any tools of any kind to pick up thunder eggs here. I mean, you can dig them out of the hillside, but is that nuts? Look at that, that is pure craziness. You're finding clusters like this everywhere. Uh, the, this is on a claim, on a federal claim. The folks that have kindly left this open for people to dig here do ask that you respect the land, you don't leave your trash here, and you backfill your holes, please. Um, and that should apply to any place that you're digging at. Don't be a jerk. Uh, so come on in. Let's take a closer look at some of the material here. Uh, there's red plume agate and some of this stuff. And, you know, when these get cut on a saw, you're going to see some that have this beautiful agate. I suspect that this will actually fluoresce under a UV light. Um, like I said, there are lots and lots of these that are doubles, triples, quadruples. I don't even know what to call the one I just had in my hand before. Um, you can see this one that's broken open on the end cap. There's some nice agate in there. Uh, just some really nice pieces. So, uh, words of advice, if you're digging, uh, sorry, we're about 55, 5,600 feet. I, we may be even higher than that. And we've been digging, so I'm a little winded. Uh, but, you know, be respectful of the land. Um, also, uh, with that respect, be aware what your physical limitations are. Uh, you know, we're out here for days on end. No shower, no running water. Uh, I know we smell bad. And uh, we're packing in all of our water, all of our food. Uh, bring chapstick. Your lips get just fried in this. Wear sunscreen. Wear the glasses. The glasses not just from the sun, but also to protect your eyes when you're digging. You only get two of them. Um, bring the right tools. Bring the right clothes. Uh, we were down in a, a canyon earlier today, and we came across a rattlesnake skin that it had shed. There are rattlesnakes here. Uh, be cognizant of your environment, and just don't go stomping around. Uh, if you're you know, in places where you're unsure and you just can't really identify things that are around you, uh, it's okay to toss rocks in front of you. It'll startle rattlesnakes. Um, so uh, this is Jim Urbanic, the rock guy, signing off. Enjoy.